You know, I went to his farm. I checked his chicken. You remember I touched the feed and I said, I must know. The one making the feed. Where you're making this feed. And then, Hi guys, we are here in Jinja. Yes, once again. We saw your chicken. Uh huh. And we wanted to know how you make the feeds, where you make the feeds. These are Katap's eggs. You come with eggs, they give you the feeds. Really? Butter trade. This is tip top poultry feeds. Poultry feeds. Yeah. Tip top poultry feeds in Jinja here in Kazimingi. If you. Uh -huh. Bugembe agari ya wamu Bugembe agari ya wamu Bugembe agari ya wamu Agari ya wamu Bugembe agari ya wamu You get the secret? This is what he gives us We want him to take us through the process How he makes the feeds How the quality feeds are delivered And how you get them the site The first thing we need to do it's too fast to clean the environment where we are. Hygiene is key. Hygiene is key. Yes. So we can yes. put this. Poultry. Uh -huh. uh, the master key in poultry is the hygiene. Exactly. When you don't keep in hygiene, you can't get what you need in mm -hmm. poultry. Mm -hmm. So the best, key, the best, the best, the best important things is hygiene. hygiene. That's what we first mm -hmm. have to consider. So we have first to clean here. We first clean. Uh huh. And we make sure that the press is clean. Yes. Then we start to measure and we mix. Ah, great. Kataps. Wanji. Get the eggs aside. <laughs> I will do the sipping and then you're done. Keep it farming with aim agriculture. Uh, he's called Mr. Abubakar. This is a feed expert. He's a feed engineer, I can call him that way. Yeah, yeah he has done <laughs> yes, it for me. So he's done as many evidence uh, and the experience with him. So, what do we need to make to start making a feed? Uh, the first things we do, mm -hmm. if we are, we are making feeds, first of all, we look around the place mm -hmm. so that the, the place must be clean. We first clean the press very well and we make sure that even even people from outside they don't tamper with the press so that they don't cause the disease to the bats because our people they put money because they need profit mm. <laughs> so when you cause bad uh, when you bring diseases from outside then it affects the the farmer very well because the, the, the diseases come from the feet, yeah. they come from the toilet, the toilet. they step here, yeah. and, and the, you don't know where we are moving from. And the chicken is going to feed directly to farm the farm. farm. Some farm of them farm. are farmers because they from, other, from farms ah. to other farms. Uh -huh. So, so we the first put that saturate in the uh -huh. press. Uh -huh. By and security? We yes. We clean the press very well. And we start, first of all, when we are going to start, we make sure that our weighing scales, it is in a proper position. Uh -huh. And you can bring it can and we show that. Yes. So we put it this way or how okay, how do you make it now? Then if you are going to measure mm -hmm. for our customers' feeds, mm -hmm. we make sure that we call our customers yes. to come and see what we are measuring. Uh -huh. Oh, that is what they call trust. Trust mm -hmm. and confidence. In you. Yes, because the quality for us we are here because of our customers. Uh -huh. Without them we can't be here. Mm -hmm. So we take them as important things in our business. Then, if you are going to measure, we first test the scale whether it is balancing like it is. Mm -hmm. Now it is in proper position, and we bring. Can you bring maize blend? Great. Here I will work. <laughs> uh, we are going to start with the maize brand. Maize jam. Other people they call it maize jam. So we put it on the scale? Yes. We can put on the scale. Oh. Feeds we are going to mix today for our customers capsin. Yes. We are going to measure to to use concentrates. And this is uh, layers. Layers. Yes. Buds for eggs. Ah. As you are seeing there, 
Those are eggs. This is your work. It is my work. Bring a tray. We want to see. Ah, quality eggs with a this is your feed. Yes. This is the concentrate. I'm the one who give them the feed, the feeds, then for them they bring for me eggs and I sell them. Ah, <laughs> you can no you like to <laughs> so it is true. <laughs> like you need the loan first to be, to get the feeds. Guys at home, guys in Kenya, let us We talk. do better better trades. If you don't have customers for eggs, for us we have it. We just give you the feeds and you bring the eggs and we sell it and we give you money. Or we give you food. I wish my people in Kenya could just learn about this. The Ugandan sector is so organized. Very. Look at this type of eggs from just a concentrate called cow dice. Nice. You make your own feed, you get such quality eggs. Let's proceed. We have our maize brand. Now, we want to test the scale. Cow mm -hmm. their formula. We follow the formulas for cow days because we need the customer to get the production as it is. So we measure 75. This one it is 70. We are going to add five on it. Yes. We can bring five kgs. Five kgs for top up? Uh, in 50 kgs of concentrates, cow days concentrates, we put on broken maize broken uh, we put on maize 100 kgs uh -huh. and we put on brand number two we have number two and number three in layers birds for eggs we use number two and broken plus lime as we are going to see when we are mixing I'm confused you're confused <laughs> you can repeat again in layers, in layers, uh -huh. yes. the formula mm -hmm. we bring or we put 100 of, of maize broken mm -hmm. and we put on maize jam 75. Correct, lime, limestone it is 25. Mm -hmm. Then we put on concentrated 50 kgs only, only. <laughs> and you get the production as we are seeing. That is, eggs. that is how simple it is. Simple as it is. Wow. That is always our signature. Like guys, I'm so shocked. Like almost only five things. Only five. Don't temper with the formula. When you temper with the formula, you can you can affect the birds. Whether whether you fail to get what you want or to bring it to die because of your tempering with the formula for the companies. And even us, when we are mixing, uh, when we are using cowardice, we follow the formula for the company of concentrate. Bring this cowardice We want to see it as we talk. Cowardice. Uh -huh. So this is the thing. This is the This thing. is the secret. Yes. This is a concentrate. Oh, it's something simple. So the mix. We don't add anything. Nice smell. Hmm? Mm. It smells mm. good. It's palatable. Yeah. Mm. It smells nice. Mm. These are things which hen is when they're eating, they start singing. You're like, what? Wow. Very, very nicely yeah. tasting. I've never eaten this, but I've already smelled it. Mm, it smells nice like <laughs> it smells sweet. nice, but you want to And even taste. the bird they, <laughs> they enjoy those smell. Really? <laughs> yes. When you enter the bird is cool like this, uh -huh. you have the sound changing. Wow. Meaning the fruit is smelling well. Yeah, we go. On. Now we've measured. We are 75. And it's the same formula huh. we used when we are mixing feeds for our customer. This is our, our, our great customer. This is the chairman. We call it chairman. <laughs> seven. He has years. supported us for many years. We have been here. So you are a chairman. With here. him. Let's continue. So let's put <laughs> In the making. <laughs> so we have our 75 kilos of bran. Eh? Yes. This is bran. Eh? Yes. So we pour it down. Yes. Come on. Uh, great. So we've already cleaned the place. The place is already cleaned. Ah. I just pour down. Yeah. Oh. Do it, do it. You will pour up. So, um, bran is bran is a very important component in feed formulation because 
Bran helps in digestibility. It makes the stool to be firm. There's no much diarrhea because of bran. And, and the use... second thing, mm -hmm. when we use only broken, yes, those birds they grow fats, ah, huh. which can make them not to lay. To lay. Seeing a brown thing on the chest of a bird, uh -huh. I'm told it is a fat. Uh -huh. Once it comes on your bird, it's cutting. It is completely hard. You can't cut it. Once it has gained the fat, it's hard to cut. It's so even... it's better you get the right formulation mm -hmm. from the right people mm -hmm. and avoid the fat. So guys, you've gotten that one. We use bran and number two maize because you don't want the chicken to get very... Now they are bringing broken maize so that as, as I told you, that we we use 100 kgs of broken so you measure it again i measure so that the customer to see it is 100 exactly exactly because this thing like this uh -huh. when it swings no no i can see it has <laughs> balanced it, it has, has clicked it has clicked actually, and it's yeah. at, a, at one at one so that is 100 100 wow. this is very authentic wing machine so we go and add on there yes 75 kilos of brand 75 kilos of brands uh, so you know i same? enjoy i enjoy a day of shopping feeds uh -huh. because i'm um, here yeah, oh. like you're not learning how to measure, I didn't do mathematics, but... <laughs> <laughs> Can we have a look at the sample of the quality? And okay. second of that, for us, we don't hand the formula to the customer. Uh -huh. We give you the formula. Read? Yes. And see what you are getting. Yes. Uh -huh. Clean maze. Uh, in my country, <laughs> we call this Chenga Chenga. Chenga Chenga. Meaning? In Kenya. Yes, Chenga Meaning? Chenga. Uh, chenga Chenga broken maize. Broken maize. Uh, yeah. And even, by the way, my people, I want you to understand one thing. If you look at this broken maize of the guys using here at Tip Top Feeds, it's not like ours at home. Ours has got a lot of the, the maize cobs, part of the maize cobs, something uh, that looks like a, like a msumari. Msumari. Yeah. The, the, the inside of the maize. The, is the, uh, the, the thing that holds the maize from the, to the to maize the cob. cob. Yes, when they are so shedding. they crush it. They crush they it when crush it's it. there. Mm, and oh. when it's there. So, you see, this one is very different quality. That's why they should come tip top and buy here because it's not expensive for crossing the border. Uh -huh. You see, again, very dry, like he said, free of moisture. If you want to know that maize free is not dry, plastic. put in your hand like this and mm -hmm. there is warmth. Oh, let me see. No, there's no warmth. So, that's another secret to use. If there's uh, no warmth, uh, to check if it's. No problem. We give the customers a freedom to check what he's taking. <laughs> okay, let's go. Wow, amazing. This is becoming so interesting, guys. So you can spread it. So you don't need a mixer. Even someone without a mixer can make his own feeds. You can mix. Even if... No, in Uganda, yes. for us, we know that there are some people who can't afford to buy the mixer. Uh-huh. So we are going to mix, and you are, see, you are going to see mm -hmm. The way we are mixing, mm -hmm. we, when we don't have a what? A mixer. a mixer. As the boy is doing. Ah. We first lay proper. Spread uh, everything? Spread, uh, yes. Mm -hmm. Then bring the concentrates. Can you pour that, those concentrates? So now we bring the cow dice concentrates. You can spread it. So this is their secret formula. I have always wished. And now it's not a secret it. because I have already told you the formula. <laughs> <laughs> no, for this company. Cowdice. Yes. Yes, yes. The cow So you do it like that. As simple as it is. How many years have you been doing this one? This job? It's now 40 years. The this business, is it is started with our father. Yes. And our father is still here mobilizing us. Yes. Until all of us. Guys, you, you have come back in the church. You have 40 years experience. In you will never campaign. go wrong. <laughs> <laughs> so after that, what next? We bring. Uh, can you bring the limestone? Uh -huh. Lime is very important because it brings calcium. Calcium. Uh huh. In bones, in joints, uh -huh. and eggs. Uh -huh. It helps eggs to be strong, uh -huh. and even the bad to be strong. Mm -hmm. You know, if uh, birds can. When the bats are lacking carousel, uh -huh. we put concentrates. 
other birds you see ab other birds are kneeling like this they lose carisha mm -hmm. mm -hmm. they are lame yeah. they are yes. not talking straight <laughs> <Because much. laughs> <laughs> so how many kilos of calcium are you going to use? We are going to use 25 kgs only. So this is now lime, huh? Yes. And this is black? It is black. I also first feared it. I thought it was not lime. Mm. Because uh, there are many colors. How many colors? We have two colors. Uh -huh. We have light, white, black, white when it has big particles. Mm. But the bad thing, I don't have it here. Mm -hmm. I would have showed you mm -hmm. and you see it. Mm -hmm. And we have this black one. Mm. But when we are laying, when we are making layers feeds, mm -hmm. it is good to, mess, to, to use these black ones. Mm -hmm. It is very better than the white one. Than the white one. You see now the secrets in making quality feeds? Because when, I'm put, I'm more, uh, when, when we are putting white, mm -hmm. we would have put 30. 30 kg. Aha, uh -huh. great. <laughs> because, because uh, yes, this one is stronger than the white one. Mm. That's why for us we decide to use this. The black one. The but black one. the cost of money from a farmer. Because instead of using 30 kilograms, I use 25. 25. Thank you. Cost yes. effective. Thank you. We first measure and we see whether how many kgs are there. It is 50 kgs. We are going to power 25 and we remain with 25. Because our formula, it needs only 25 kilos, kilos of lime. So we have to get how many kilograms of monobag? Uh, this formula, it is for 250 kilos. kilograms. Oh, yeah. uh -huh. Great. So you can measure. And this formula, we use only one bag of concentrates. Wow. Only one bag of concert. That means if you need two bags, just times two. You just, uh, yes. Everything, times Everything two. So times two. So one bag two. is 50 kilos of concert. Yes. And we put on broken 100, mm -hmm. maize jam 75, lime 25. 25. Yeah. We get the total 250. So you spread like this. And the reason why we don't uh, advise people to use mixer, uh -huh. it is very good. But uh, we have those low income uh, uh, low income farmers, farmers. who are starting. Starter farmers. Starter farmers. The way I started, I told these guys, the way I started, <laughs> you can't I afford. don't move a mixer, <laughs> I would run away. You <laughs> mix 10 kilograms yes. in a mixer. <laughs> so you mean, Someone in Kenya can make his own feed because you sell for him, number two, it's already crushed. You sell for him bran, it's already ready. You sell for him lime, it's already lime. ready. And he can be able to contact us in Nakuru, we supply for him the concentrate. And he just mixes his feed. Only. Ha. Ha. Guys, why should you waste your money buying feed? It's not quality. And, uh, and then the secret is there. The at, the, at the step where we are going. Let's go. Let's go. Uh -huh. We are eager now to know. Next on the. This one also. Wow. Wow. Now we are mixing. Mm -hmm. We have started mixing. Mm -hmm. When we are mixing, we make sure. That we mix, by the way, we mix three times. Mm -hmm. I really love this. Thing. It's so amazing. Uh, After now bringing uh, mixing from this together, mm -hmm. what we need, mm -hmm. we want to see this food is, is already in a good mixed state. State. And everybody can test the concentrates and maize brands and even the blocking in the same ratio in the same ratio mm -hmm. when you don't mix properly mm -hmm. other birds they miss concentrates others they eat because of mixing and they eat so more concentrate than more we lime. put more efforts on mixing that's the major thing guys you get that the mixing has to be very uniform 
Yes. That's what the expert tells us. Uh -huh. It doesn't consider how many times you have mixed, uh -huh. but you have got what you want. Correct. As you are going to see our boys doing. Can you start? Please continue. This form of mixing is for our low, low income farmers. Low income farmers. And I can see a nice. But if you have big companies and you have money, you can so buy a mixture. mixture. <laughs> <laughs> this one you save on electricity. But you see, this. this you see, uh, and, and, and even this one, mm -hmm. it is good because it serves electricity. Yes. Because in our Uganda, mm -hmm. power is very expensive. Even in my country, <laughs> Kenya. Uh, even in, I don't know, maybe in Tanzania where maybe power can be cheaper. <coughs> and the power is born here, but they do not know the source of river Nile. <laughs> and the source of river Nile here in Ginger. The government. The government. <laughs> You forget that you are in Uganda. <laughs> yeah. oh. wow. So first they do like this. Yes. And then next they mix going like this. In this part. They will mix when they're coming back to us. Uh-huh. Until those black things it disappears. Completely. Yeah. Huh? Until you see the same color. Because there you are seeing many, many colors, white, black, or whatever. Uh -huh, uh -huh. We mix until we see the same. Uniform. Uniform. We don't, we don't need rainbow in our heads. Correct. <laughs> no, no rainbow. Uh -uh. And see the sweeping. That's a very nice, very nice thing. Yes. That's one what he's doing. Uh -huh. When you don't sweep it and you correct it together, uh -huh. when you mix, those concentrates is going behind there. Yes, yes. You will leave it and you lose the. The farmer loses some of the things and then you also mix. And the, you know, the feed loses the formula. If you make feed like this, you are saving like 40% of sure. sugar than buying from the shop. If you go out to buy a mixed feed, mm -hmm. you lose about 20%. But if you come and buy these raw materials, mix for yourself, yes. with high, very high saving costs. This is the second time they are doing it. They are doing it. You can you can mix four times, three times, five, according to your what you want. Yes. But now it is starting to become uniform. And the, the, the bad thing to you, sometimes our farmers mm -hmm. they come here and they bring those things. They go there at home, they want to mix yet they don't have power to mix. They mix one and they get tired. Uh, so long as it is a bad, they will eat. That one it is very dangerous to the birds. It will not give you the, the good results. The good results. Mm -hmm. And you start complaining about feeds. You know the feeds, I buy, I bought it from there. Their feeds are not good. Yet you have the problem. And even the hygiene, it not ends here. We advise the customers yes. from here to maintain hygiene and at home. The drink it must be clean. Uh -huh. The feeders must be clean. Yes. You don't add foods when the 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 old one is still there. We'll move the the old one, put aside, and we put in another one, the new one. Guys, this is an expert. This is a feed expert speaking. He says you don't add feed on feed that was already there before. First remove the old feed, then now give the chicken new feed. If at all there is food remaining on the feed troughs. Yes. Wow. But it is something that I've always followed. Mm. When you keep feed for a long time, mm -hmm. you find that the feed is getting to harden, it's getting infections. But you, you, want, you have to understand one thing about uh, feet. You know when chicken are feeding, they drop saliva in mm -hmm. that feed. So the way the expert explained to us that you, don't, you, have a, you, have, you need to have very dry raw materials. When you have that saliva now, again, the feed, that's already water, that's already moisture. And even the water you give to them, uh -huh. you must be keen mm -hmm. and make sure that that water is very clean. 
not take us for granted that so long as it is bad, so they will take it. Yes, they will take it, wow. but you will affect them. But I have realized that birds are not joking people, and not joking subjects. Those guys, when you live their water for a long time, and it's not, you know these are systems of deep water system. Ah. That dirty water, they drink it with anger. You know a bird drinking water with anger goes with no choice. Better give them hygiene, wow. I mean clean water. Um, My goodness, this is the feed we buy from the shops. Yeah, that's what they buy from the shops. This is the feed we buy from the shops. <laughs> really? Yes. <laughs> Only packaging remaining. Aye, guys, if I take this and I put in a very nice bag, I write very nice name, I write the M yes. Agriculture Farm. That's tree. what I want to tell the people from Kenya. <laughs> so that, that they come. <laughs> By the way, guys in Kenya are always complaining about feed. Yeah. I have not seen anybody in Uganda. You know, I went to his farm. I checked his chicken. You remember I touched the feed and I said, I must know. The one making the feed. Where you're making this feed. And the girl. most asked question on my channel, mm -hmm. my YouTube channel, mm -hmm. it is, where can I get the feeds in Uganda? Cheap feeds or inexpensive feeds? Don't ask that question anymore. We have the answer. He's here. For 40 years experience. 40 yeah. years is not a joke. <laughs> <laughs> For Christians, 40 is something big. Yeah. 40 Jesus in the wilderness, 40, 40 days on the water and the floods, 40 days everything. <laughs> <laughs> so we are ready, it's done. Simple. No, they are going to mix again. Ah. Yes. Okay. Third time. Third time. Wow. Oh. After but three days, he resurrected. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so now we are almost finalizing. Oh my god. This goodness. is the last thing. Mix the stage now. Yes. Oh my goodness. And you are also seeing what I'm explaining. Uh -huh. When you look at it now, you think it's finished. I'm thinking it's finished. My goodness. You see, I, don't, I cannot even see those things here crashing. The black ones. This is amazing. Very. This is my brother. You have made family to be so interesting, so enjoyable, so simple. You see, when you start a farm and you get the wrong feed producers, you mm. might take for yes, we have many here. Very many. I'm going to take a chance mm -hmm. to show you our raw materials, the ingredients from here the local because there's one on the this is concentrate from outside the country oh, so we can also make using a local formula yes uh -huh. teachers so quite don't like all your now we have been saying when we are using concentrates those concentrates we bought it they come with from our outside of our country now we have our law materials in what we call it ingredients. Mm -hmm. This is now homemade. The other years, the past years, we have been using this. But we, we got some, some confusion because of these uh, concentrates and uh, sometimes the this cotton. Less, they make less time consuming, they are consuming. time consuming. Yes. Again, also these materials, sometimes they get scarce at some time. Uh, the season. The, the the season. season. It is yeah. season. Mm. Especially silver fish. Oh. Silver fish is just... Uh, you also use silver fish? Just yes. Day. You are not going to see here, but uh, we put on. Uh -huh. mm. We use cotton. Uh -huh. Cotton cake. This is. This one is already milled. Uh -huh. Cotton cake. Guys, remember I said you don't just use any And cotton. I'm sorry for that. This one I'm not going to give you the formula. <laughs> they should come here. You should come here. Come. When I give you the formula, you will not come you here. You will learn away. You will learn away because yes. you have already got the formula. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> this man. And we want you to give hey. you business. This cotton, I always tell you that you don't just use any cotton. You can see his cotton cake is decorticated. Yes, it, it has two types of cotton. Yes. We have to cotton which it has too much fibers. Ah. We don't use it. 
that one is rich in something called gossip oil and it's not good for chicken feed sometimes it refuses to pass here to pass there and it has got something and called... you will see your birds dying when you don't know the cause it dies because there's something called gossip oil in it it's a phytokinin which is very very poisonous to a bird so use cotton like this it's by the way this is very nice uh-huh proceed then this is sunflower cake the, the difference between the cotton mm -hmm. we use to the layers uh -huh. and brighter even brighter but sunflower cake we just give it to the layers oh layers layers because it's work to reduce the fats the Uganda chicken <laughs> feed secret. What they call an expert. <laughs> <laughs> Come again. That this one is only for layers. For layers. <laughs> Don't temper it with it to give it a blila. You may not get the results as you want it. Ah. Huh. Let's go on. Wow, wow, wow. This is our lock shells. Uh-huh. We got it from our lake Victoria. We dry it and we put it here. It is very good. When we are using this, our local materials, we put on what shells? Everything it is here, it needs when we are using this. And it is very cheaper because. Uh, lime it is for five five hundred shillings Ugandan shillings. Then this one is for four hundred shillings. Oh, so this one is cheaper in, in the space of lime. Yes. yes. So this one is good for supplying of calcium. Yes. Wow. And when we are putting shells, we don't forget bones. This is bones for animals, cow, goats. Mm, let me attach it. How do you get the bones? We collect them. Wow, bone meal. Why can it be broken? Yet. Hmm. We first burn it. Ah. So you As you are burning the charcoal. Mm -hmm. ah. mm -hmm. Why do you burn it? Uh, when you don't burn it, 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 cannot, can't, it can't pass through from the meal. The machine cannot the machine. Mean, the mean it cannot can't. And also I was thinking locally, the burning kills any other germs and even the those uh, animals they have some germs when we burn it we kill those germs yes, as you have told mm. Mm. i was thinking like a local man but now things and germs <laughs> 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 and you're a farmer you have been farming for a long time then we have another thing yes like, which one is this? we have soya this is our local soya so yes soya bean uh -huh. This soil, and we first uh, mill it. After milling it, and we get this powder. You can test it. There is some small particles in it. Yeah, what puts the smell? It's a good scent. It's a good, a good it scent, is yeah. soy. But this one is like cooked before. It's like roasted. Uh, yes, it is roasted. Guys, we first roast it. Understand that this point very well. Understand it very well. Don't just go and harvest your soya, you dry and you crush, and you give your chicken. And then you start saying that the expert gave you the formula. Please tell them why. Why do you lost it? You see, it is cooked. Because if a cow eats raw beans, the stomach, and then it dies. It is roasted so that the phytokinins, the chemicals in it, that will act as poison are destroyed. It's like pre-cooked. This one even I can eat. It has no problem. Yeah. So you're trying to eat, eat it with my chicken. But this is so new, so you can test it. <laughs> <laughs> why, 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 why are you giving chicken? Hey, why, are you giving, no, why are you giving a chicken feed that you cannot eat? Then something is wrong. Ah. Mm, you see, I'm eating. I got a new meal now. It has a life as you have. <laughs> Yes. Ah, that's very nice. And guys, this. So apart from this, now after someone has this, he brings in now maize and. Uh, yes, you have to have maize mm -hmm. and maize brand. Mm -hmm. It also must be there to complete this feed. Yes. 
and the formula is a secret. That's we want you to come here to Uganda for yourself. Yes, if you need the formula, come.